two miles, average pace, nine minutes, 59 seconds per mile. I don't make you cookies. What's up, Facebook? Family and friends. Y'all know this your boy, Flim Gym 101 Trainer. Sign a suit layer challenge. Running for blessings and prayers. All right, I want to send a shout out to two people before I start talking. First one is James Scott from Baton Rouge and uh, Miss Michelle Binya. I think that's how you pronounce your name. If I'm pronouncing it wrong, please correct me later on. But uh, I really want to dedicate this run to them two because uh, Miss Michelle, for one, she always on my page liking stuff positive things always motivating me she always know how to you know get me up and going and i just want to thank you and thank god for putting you for putting us in one another's life you know what i mean james i also want to dedicate this run to you too brother because you know you always like and hitting the like button i always comment and i always want to see what's going on in my life man positive on the positive side and you know, I just want to say God bless you also, man. And may God be with you and your family. You too, Miss Michelle. But mainly, you know, I did this run today. Because, you know, I'm always doing God's work, you know. God just tell me to talk to the people that that's afraid to talk to him. So, you know, he sent me your way because half of the people in the world don't want to talk to God. They... They too hard, uh, you know, too, too much to talk to God, or too manly, or whatever you want to call it. But man, ain't no, you never too much to talk to that man. That man never gonna make things happen, man. So I just come to tell y'all, you know, he told me to tell y'all, hang in there, be strong, believe, pray, repray, and then pray again. Like he said, it might not come right then and there. But trust me, you're going to be on time. I wouldn't care if you don't have the money for your prescription. Just keep praying. You're going to make sure it happens. I wouldn't care if you don't have the money for your bills. Keep praying. You're going to make something happen. You trying to steal? You still filling out applications? And I mean nobody trying to hire you. Hey, man, keep praying. Keep believing. God said he's going to make something happen. A lot of y'all, man, you know, only go to God when y'all need him. You need to start going to him and just thanking him. Say, hey, man. And I'm, let me tell you something, bro. Ain't no wrong way to talk to God, man. God is a humorous God, man. Sometimes I wake up. What's up, Mr. Benny? Sometimes I wake up and I'll be like, hey, what's up, my man? How you doing this morning? Say, bro, I appreciate you, bro, for waking me up this morning, man. He ain't going to send me to hell for that. He ain't going to. You know, I mean, punish me for that. I mean, come on, man. He's a parent. It's just like, you know, if you, if you talk to your mom and dad with a, you know, you still got to have respect. But there's no wrong way to talk to God, man. I don't care if you thugged out. If you thugged out, talk to him thuggish. He'll understand. You shy, talk to him shy. You bold, talk to him bold. Man, God made you, man, so he know what you're about. Ain't no sense of trying to hide yourself from him and, and pretend you something else because he already know what you're about. So you can't be fake to him. You can't hide nothing from him. He already know. He know what's going to happen tomorrow. He know what's going to happen today. He know what's happening right now. But like I say, man, he told me to tell y'all, you know, if you scared to go to him, then that's why he's sending me to these blessings and prayers so y'all can come in. And I'll shoot your name to him. I'll shoot your name to him. Because I am doing his work. I'm telling you. And I'll shoot your name to him. And once I shoot your name to him. i leave that up to him. I did my part. Once I finish running. And once I finish my. My speech after my run. My little words of wisdom. Man. God take over from there. Like I said man. You going through some things in your relationship. God say pray. Repray and pray again. Believe. Trust in him. He's gonna make it happen. Trust. Him. 
we gotta start believing in God more, man. Especially when we need Him less. Not when we need Him most. When we need Him less, we need to start praying. We need to start just thanking Him. Letting Him know what He did. Instead of always asking for a favor, like start giving back to Him, man. And watch what He do. You'll be surprised. I'm telling you, man. I mean, I'm not just doing this, bro. I'm telling you, man. He, he giving me the strength to do this, man. I just got off work. I just finished. I mean, at least, at least 300 houses. I mean, reaching, pulling, reaching, pulling, getting out, getting in, getting out, getting in. Good thing I ain't got to run from no dogs right now. But like I say, man, he give me the strength to come home. And still pull his running for blessings and prayers out. He's like, hey, Ariel. So he said, hey, son. He said, man, I got two of them. He said, as soon as you post it, man, I got two of them that's going to either like, love it, or comment. He said, you, you don't have too many today. I said, whatever you need me to do, God, whatever you need me to do, I got you, man. So I'm just letting y'all know, man, this video for y'all, man. You watch this, man. This. God say he love you, no matter what, no matter what you're doing, as long as you're trying, as long as you're trying, making an effort to change, to do right, you know, as long as you're trying to get that job, instead of saying I'm going to go get a job and begging God to get you a job, it don't work like that, instead of saying, you know, I mean, if you're trying, like if you're really trying, you really going to fill out applications? And you saying, God, give me a job. Please help me get a job. Man, I promise you, man. I promise you. That man going to help you get a job. That's me promising for God. So like I say, man. Anything you need. Anything that you're going through. Anything that's going on in your life. And you feel like you're at the bottom. God told me this video for you. God told me he's going to touch you. He's going to put hands on you. All he wants you to do is pray. He believe it. Pray, repray, and pray again. He got you. God is real, man. God is good. It's your boy, Flim Jim 101 Training. Running for blessings and prayer. Sonic Suit Layer Challenge. Man, I'm out, man.